Hello and welcome, I am Helle from Game for Life BG and today I'm going to do an unboxing of Terraforming Mars, the dice game. This is a Kickstarter edition I have of the game and this game is for one to four players. It takes about 45 minutes to play. But let's look at this dice version of Terraforming Mars. And this here is the back side. So we have the Mars some cards and then a lot of dice. Let's have a look inside the box. We have a uh, skip the rule book, so they have made a, an interactive tutorial for the game. And we have rules, they are nicely coded. Overview and setup, pretty thick pages, playing the game. Playing a card, game concept, end of game, then we have solo play, and that's it. So, uh, 12 places in all, and then an overview page. Then, I guess this is the designers of the game, and some more people. Alright, here we have... Is that then companies, the default different colors? So you have the normal colors, red, blue, green, and yellow, and the fabric. Then we have an overview. So I guess this is a player help. So we have a production turn, dice overview, and then action turn, and then main action. So you can choose one of these main actions. I did try it when we were at Essen last year. We just played a couple of rounds. Can't really remember it that well. So I will have to read the rules again. And this is this is the other side. So something for the play oh that's for us playing the solo version. And then you can see how well you have done. So there are two of these. And then we have a player board. Mass. And on the other side, oh, is there a difference here? Um, let's look at this one. Yeah, there's a difference. There's a difference in the setup. So I can't see that it's depending on the number of players. So maybe you just have two different sides you can use when you play the game. Fine board. And then. We have more tokens. So we have all of these tokens. And let's just have a look at the other side. It's kind of the same. So water, tree, fabrics, different tokens, and these with question marks on them. This is a pretty thick cardboard. Let's just see how it punch. It punch out easy. So that's easy to punch out. And then we have cubes. This is for the different temperature and the oxygen, I guess. And then for each of the players. And then we have cards. But let's look at the dice first. We have some extra bags, and then we have dice in this one. Yes, we have 12, we have leaves, then we have this symbol, two of those, and then we have the paw for animal. So three leaves, one animal, and then, is that the micros? And we have some, looks like water dice. With the three lightnings, two drops, and then oxygen. So that is blue dice and then yellow dice. Oh, I like dice, guys. So I have to recall how this was played. This looks like earth, euros, and then samples of some kind, and then money. That is what you have on the yellow die. It is a nice light dice. They're not that heavy, but it seems like a good quality. 
and we have a red with temperature and then with a arrow and then this one and finally we have some gray dice so 12 of each that is five that is 60 dice then we have this hammer fabric a star so three hammers two stars and one I mean, industry or something so that is the five different dice oh looking forward to this guys that is it and then we have bags and then we have cards Stronghold games, Lakerfront resorts, different corporations. So I guess this must be some special abilities you're going to start with, depending on which of these you're going to get. So that was there are three, six of these, and then we have these bonus efficiency. Oh, this is different bonus cards. This is some different cards. Maybe this is for the Kickstarter. Oh, looks like it has the same backside as those. Well, that was in the little one. It could be that that was something for the Kickstarter. I can't remember how that was, if there were anything special. Okay, so I just opened all of the three decks here. These all have the same background and it's a nice quality, the cards. They are encoded. It's nice smooth, going to be easy to shuffle them. So this is different cards we can get and you need those dice, I guess, to uh, get the cards, to get them down. And then I think this is your ability you're going to get. And here you get an action. If you have one of those, you can maybe Raise the temperature. Oh, not raise it. Yeah, raise the temperature, of course. This one is expensive, but you will then get this one. Maybe uh, uh, raise the temperature and get a water or something. Or when you do that, you are going to gain this. Yeah, I have to... Uh, it's been a long while. I, I only tried a demo at the Essen. So cards, when you're going to get a lot of different abilities. Oh, I like the art on the cards. Lava flows, lichen, livestock, so animal cards, a lot of cards. You're just going to swap quickly through these. So uh, if you want to see anything, <laughs> lots of animals and different things out in space, I guess has to of course be in Mars, since we are going to terraform Mars. <laughs> so we have a lot of cards. That was the first deck. We have two more. I think I'll take this one first. We have a different color here. So we have some different cards there. So this is also the normal cards we're going to get, and we're going to use the dice to get some of all of these cards. I'm just going to go quickly through them here, because, yeah, there is a lot of cards. This one was an expensive one too. Beautiful! And then we have more of those. Let's just do like this. Here we have... Oh, this is still cast like this, I think. There was an expansion in it too. So maybe let's just look at these. Should I then put them on the top here? Well, we got more cards. I think I have to look. Maybe it, yeah, I don't know. But I think on the lid it did say that there was an expansion. Or was it on the back side? But a lot of cards, for sure. And then we have kind of two of the same, so this must be corporations again. 
so this is some corporations for different starting powers. And uh, we had more. We have more had more corporations here. Do they have the same background? Yeah, they do. They do have the same background. Base cards. Ah, this one is the same. So this one, you're not going to play with this one though. So this did did one say base cards? And this one said. Okay, base cards and cooperative error cards. And then, what did this one say? Promo cards. Yeah, so I think the first one, that is uh, from, that must be from the Kickstarter, the promo cards. And then maybe I shouldn't. Can I see any? Yeah, this one has a yellow dot here, which matches here. Yes, yeah, so. So all these are kind of with the error cards here. They have a little yellow, I think. Maybe that was an expansion. And this one, bonus cards, they also have the yellow at the bottom. So therefore you, you can distinguish them. So these matches together. This is co cooperate error cards. And then this is base game cards. So this is for the normal base game. And there's also some bonus cards. All of these, they are base cards. So that is that is a pretty huge stack here of base cards. And then we had these, which they are all error cards. So I think this is an expansion. And then we have these that are promo cards. And they all have this icon down here, so you can distinguish them from the other cards. So that was normal cards and bonus cards. And I guess you can just put them in and play with the normal game. So this is all you're going to get in this terrifying mass dice edition. And then we have this divider here where we can place the different type of cards in here. And of course, all of the dice. Yeah, I just look forward to reading the rules and playing the game again. But that was my unboxing of the game. Thanks for watching.